and the first stop was the area within Monrovia that he used to control during the war. So this was my, this was my control, control area. And who, who would be attacking? Chastiller men, NPF, they were calling themselves government forces at the time. Right here, this is where I have my crutch, my crutch chair. Yeah. I sat in the chair. My boys are all around yeah. singing. The, the, the elders bring the an innocent child yeah. and we open the back of the child, thrust out the heart. Alive? Yes. And we cut it to pieces and dis distribute it to the boys. And what does that do? Just make them brave and charge them for the battle with the belief that bullet will not get affect them. us or get them. This last thing was still on my hand. Mm. When my boys went for water, just before they got back, and I heard a voice behind me, my son, why are you slaving? But this was in my dialect. Mm. I said, Andrew, there came you away. To look back, I saw this man in Laney, white Laney, but the light radiated through that, through that man mm. was so bright and brighter than the sun. Mm. And then I thought I was not a slave because he said, my son, why are you slaving? Mm. I said, wow. Well, in this whole territory, I'm the king. Mm. I'm supposed to be a king. And he said, you rightly say you're supposed to be a king, but you're living like a slave. Mm. And those words were very hard words in my dialect. Mm. I said, I don't understand. What did he say? I may repent and live or refuse and die. Mm. And he vanished. And the light vanished. Mm. And I came up to myself and I was so confused. Now, to go for battle, I tried to signal the battle. My pistol got bust. I got so afraid and retreated from the front. Mm. I got afraid for the first time. I say that you shall know the truth. I've been receiving some dangerous calls, but people have been threatening me. And why they try to kill me is what I want to make meaning about today. I am an old sinner. I was about the age of 11 and was initiated as a priest to my tribe. I did a lot of human sacrifices, killed a lot of innocent people. Now I know I was wrong, but thank God that extended his mercy to me through Jesus Christ. The Bible says in the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 28, he said, all things, thing, not some things, but every single thing works together for good. But one thing I am sure of, I am convinced that I'm called by God's own purpose. And once you are called by God's purpose, the Bible says all things work together for good. You shall know the truth and the truth